What is the appeal of cat owned and black cat for you? Well, um, nothing on the chest area at all. No, um, <laughs> she, I, I love Catwoman. She's such a feisty character. And, well, she gets on with Batman quite a bit, so that's all right. And <laughs> black cat? Um, well, Vicky wanted to do a pair cosplay, and I love Spider-Man, so I've come as Black Cat. Tell me about these costumes, because you're looking mighty fine, I must say, both of you. Where did you get this from? Um, well, most of it from eBay, actually. <laughs> um, but I put it together myself, so it was quite hard to get everything all together in one place, but yeah. Now, who, what kind of look inspired you? Because Catwoman has come in many guises, hasn't yeah. she? Um, well, I'm actually the Adam Hughes version. He's, he's done um, comic covers for Catwoman, and he does the specific red goggles, and I love the red goggles, so I decided to come as that. And how comfy are you in that, or is it super hot? Um, it's quite hot, yeah. Um, not at all comfy, and um, you definitely can't stand around for very long in these heels. So. And how about you, Black Cat? Um, most of my costumes are like, assembled, like bought off the internet with like bits of fur sewn on, but I made the mask. How do a couple of cats keep cool during a convention like this? Trying to stay near drafts of air, um, open doors, that, that helps, um, and drinking a lot. <laughs> and what about cosplay tips for other people who might be just starting out? Um, be confident in what you do, and never do something half assed always go for all the way. And how about you, Black Cat? I think pretty much the same thing. If you put your heart into it, people can tell. It doesn't matter if the character doesn't look like you, just as long as you put your heart into it.